tantalizing thing about Francisco Costa's career at the moment is watching the way his design sensibility is looming over what we think of as Calvin Klein's aesthetic. You've got a bit of history with Calvin Klein. I do. I did my first Calvin show here upstairs. It was a minimalist collection and I walked out right after Iman. And now here I was, and here was Calvin, who was connected to Liz and Liza in Studio 54, and he was dressing me, and I was in it, and of it, and part of it. Basically, we want to make it look more futuristic, because when you look at the clothing, there's a lot of sport. I saw, you know, when you think of the players with the zinc under the eyes, or, you know, football players, and you look quite daring, and using it. It's a warrior eye, isn't mm, it? But then so soft, so it is a fun look. Quite a lot going on in those clothes. Well, they're long and short, and they're fine and smocking, yet somehow they all look minimalist. And that smocking reminded me of my favorite dresses when I was five. They look great. It's almost like really, you know, coming out of a tunnel. There's a sort of a Blade Runner quality in that. There was kind of a sci-fi thing going on. Yeah, it is, because I mean, I also, I mean, look at the future is one thing, but also you want to bring the stuffness, the street, you know, this very New York kind of influence. So this whole section of dark indigo colors, no black, the dye is really indigo. So it was really tremendous research to get that going, because it's very rare. It was just fun to work on it and see how they would translate. It was very modern to begin with, and then it kind of kind of went a little bit more kind of classic, very beautiful. I mean, structured, and then I liked it when it got very flowy at the end. You don't want to get too close to the flame around some of those dresses. <laughs> so I really like the mix of fabrics. White croc, white chiffon, gotta love it. We all need it. It's obvious from the way Francisco designs how he feels about women. The complexity of these clothes, combined with their extremely seductive nature, is a kind of double whammy of womanhood.